Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm back with the bonus love reads and uh, this time I'm doing this reading for only 5 signs which got the most views for the last reads that I uploaded which includes water signs, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer and Sagittarius and the last one is going to be the Taurus but this reading is going to be for the sign of Sagittarius so Sagittarians, let's get into the read for you guys um, topic of the reading is uh, for those of you who are dealing with the person who you are in no communication with right now there is a person in your love life that you really want to reconcile with. You wish that you could come together, you could have a bad trip, but then you don't know if your person really wished the same or not. So you really want to know, do they wish to reconcile with you? Yes or no? We're going to find the answer to that. We will also take messages from your person as well. We will also guide you through uh, uh, you know, the right path forward as well using the uh, Oracle deck as well. So stay tuned. And uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there, so always pick the messages which are resonating and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. So, whoever it is that you are dealing with, let's find out. Do they wish to reconcile with you? Yes or no? Whoever it is that you are dealing with. Do they want to come back, patch up with you? Yes or no? Page of Cups. There is definite love in this connection. Um... They really want to come forward, they really want to come back, they really want to message you. But right now, with the first card that came out when I was shuffling, there was this Eight of uh, Wands, which came out as, uh, you know, kind of, uh, um, you know, in, in, in an um, upside down position. So they are right now, uh, they have love, but they are holding themselves back from communication with you. They are not communicating to you purposely. So why is that so? Let's find out. They do have love though, but do they wish to reconcile with you? Let's find out. <clears throat> they do have love, but do they want to come back with you? Yes or no? The moon. If you really want to come back with this person, yes, they also want the same. Whatever you wish with them, they also wish the same with you. If you want to reconcile, yes, they want to reconcile too. If you want to reconcile with them after some time, they will want the same as you. So if you are in love with this person and if you really want things to pace up, I would suggest you to use the technique where you know that uh, your person is going to think exactly what you are thinking of uh, them if you uh if you really want love to come from this person you really have to start believing and thinking that your person loves you more than you love them because the more you're going to think of or the image that you hold in your head around this person is going to manifest in your reality like you know right now if you believe that your person doesn't love you they don't value you they have uh, ignored you for other things and other areas of their life you are manifesting exactly that. If you really want this person to express their love and you start saying that as an affirmation to yourself, like, you know, your person is more expressive to you. They always express their love and emotions openly and honestly. If you use those kind of affirmations with which, which align you with what you truly desire, you will have exactly that with your person. So using the law of attraction to work in your favor is going to help you a lot to get what you want with your person. So make sure you manifest it. Make sure you work towards, like, you know, it's, it's always working 24-7. It's just that somehow maybe you are thinking negative around the connection right now. Maybe you believe that your person doesn't love you. Maybe they don't wish to, you know, come back to you the way they do. Just that maybe you have some... Um, you know, not so positive thoughts around it. Maybe you think about the blocks that you have right now in this connection. You need to stop thinking about the blocks. You need to stop thinking about the things that you desire to have in this love life situation with your person. So they do have love for you. But yes, right now, uh, things are not moving forward. Why? Because your person is holding themselves back purposely. Now you need to change that idea of your person. You have to start believing that your person is no more holding themselves back and they're coming forward with the expression of their love and they're openly and honestly expressing their love to you as much as you want them to. So that's going to become the new reality for you. So let's see one more card here. Do they wish to reconcile with you? Eight of Cups. Four of Pentacles. They really wish to, but right now they are holding themselves back. How do you do or uh, what do you do? To, to get what you want with them, I will let you know. Hold on. Page of Swords. Right now, your person is holding themselves back, but they are definitely keeping a check on you on social media and on other, uh, other uh, you know, uh, uh, platforms as well. This person is keeping a check on you. They are right now holding themselves back. What is the reason behind that? I don't know. It will be different for different people. Maybe they are... Uh, 
they want to reconcile with you but then there are situations circumstances which are stopping this person they could be you know busy with their work scenarios maybe they don't have enough time maybe they believe that you know you want to get married to them and they cannot get married to you right now that could be the case for some of you now the moment you change your idea of this person and what they are thinking of you you will start seeing positive change in this person's attitude towards you. So if you ask me, do they wish to reconcile with you? Yes, they want to, but right now I don't see them taking any action towards you. They really want to keep a check on you. As of now, they don't want to reconcile, to be very honest. Eventually, they would want to reconcile with you. Right now, they are keeping a check on you, so you don't move on to somebody else or you don't move on with another person and another relationship. But yes, um, they, they really have love for you, for sure. Uh, but yes, something needs to end. Maybe they are wearing a mask right now to stay away from you. They are holding themselves back purposely. So they do have love. They are trying to um, stay away from you. That's what I'm picking up very strongly. Why do they do that? I don't know. It will be different for different people. But seems like you know that's going to end. And then this person is going to come forward and would want to reconcile with you. But if, if you start, you know, if you really want things to pace up in the situation between the two of you, uh, you can use the law of attraction to work in your favor uh, by thinking the thoughts that you want to see in your love life with your person. So, yeah, let's see the messages from your person. Let's see what do they wish to tell you? What are their messages? What are their messages? What do they wish to tell you? I am starting to understand our connection. I feel like, you know, this person is going to take their time to understand the connection better. Now, again, if you start using affirmations, it's going to benefit you a lot. And it will get you what you want with your person quick. Let's see more cards here. Let's see what else do they wish to tell you. I am not available. They might have said that to you. And now uh, it's, it's more like uh, in this detachment, in this separation, this person is going to make you, uh, uh, you know, um, they, they're going to understand the connection better is what I'm picking up. So it, it's, it's going to be uh, this this breakup, this ending, this time apart is going to be beneficial for the two of you and for the connection is what I'm picking up. Um, maybe right now you don't see it that way, but it will be so. Um, I was my, uh, sorry, it was my fault, but I blamed you. So your person could be right now pulling away purposely. Again, maybe there is something that uh, they, they believe cause of which um, they are pulling themselves away. Like, you know, maybe they believe they cannot get married to you right now for whatever reason. Maybe they are not strong enough to stand, uh, you know, tall for what they believe to have with you in front of their family, maybe. It can be something else as well. But they they are definitely right now telling you that you, they are not available to you right now. Not because they are not. It's just that they are acting as if. There is a mask your person has on and they will take that mask off soon. Uh, because they do have love so it's more like you know they're right now hiding their truthful feelings and emotions from you running away from it and uh, but soon they are going to express it all so the other message is i remember the day we met like it was yesterday this person really missed you a lot though um but right now holding their emotions back so you are always on your uh sorry you are always on my mind so this person does think a lot about you let's see what the oracle has to add to the read let's see what are the guidance for the two of you in this connection hold the space for some of you maybe your person is somebody who is um <sighs> try to relax around the situation currently and try to just just live in the moment and try to let it be i feel like you know um maybe you don't understand this time apart is gonna bring you what you want Maybe you're taking it as, a, as, a, as an ending to your connection. It's not going to be the case. Just know what you desire and know that the divine has a better plan to go about it. So you will eventually get what you want with your person. Just try to just live in the moment. And um, uh, maybe, you know, as you have this time apart, maybe there are certain things that you need to work on yourself as well. Try to work on those things and uh, let your person understand the connection better and come towards you when they are ready. Uh, so yeah, let's see one more card. We do have the growth card. For some of you, you might be in a twin flame journey and you have to grow as an individual first before you could come together to have the kind of life that you both desire to have with each other. So that could be the case for some of you as well. So yeah, that's pretty much it coming up for you for this reading. If it helped you to know, uh, you know, uh, the connection better or if it helped you to know the answer that you were seeking with this read, do like, share, and subscribe. If you are willing to get a personal reading, you can check the description box for that. If you are willing to purchase affirmations, 
Uh, I have two set of uh, affirmations that I offer. Uh, affirmations will be, be you know, uh, will be made based on your uh, situation and your love life. They will be customized accordingly. But yes, I do offer two different affirmations. One is spiritually and the spiritually charged ones and the other is the other ones. Uh, which is for five minutes i believe so yeah you can check the description box for further details on that and uh, if you need my assistance around it you can uh, purchase them but you can always make your own affirmations as well so yeah till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye bye